wow. I don't know how many times I'm going to say unique, but this is this is crazy. Like epic levels of uniqueness here. What if I told you that somebody recreated a point and click adventure game in Super Mario Maker 2? Honestly, at first I was quite skeptical, but I did see a video from Blue Television Games showing this level off and what the intricacies are involved with it, how the depth perception really messes with your mind, and there's even a miniature map and an arrow pad that you control with Mario. It looks to be one of the most unique and intricate level designs I have ever seen in Super Mario Maker 2 and furthermore, in any Mario game ever. This course truly shows off what you're able to do with Super Mario Maker 2 and the editing tools. In this episode, we're gonna be taking a look at a very unique Mario Maker 2 level that was created by, well, I don't know, because I don't read Japanese, but it is called 3D Maze House, and the description is in all Japanese. Apparently, from what I understand, this is a reincarnation of the old school NES games like Shadow Gate and Uninvited, things like that, which I have no idea how that's going to work in Mario Maker. Here, it pushes me off to the bottom. I can't even see myself. Let me walk over to this, bounce up, like this. Okay, that's interesting. Let's go through this door and check it out. All right, so this looks like the bottom right corner. It looks like an arrow pad, just like the old school, like I said, uninvited in Shadowgate. There are three different directions you can go outside of the one you come from. And in the top left of the screen, you can see it looks like a 3D box, just like Shadowgate. Let's go in here and see what it's like. Oh, that is amazing. That is amazing. So, <laughs> it shows the map in the bottom left corner, and the picture in the top right switches every time you go a different direction. So I'm going to go up this time. Let's see where this takes me. That is wild. The only thing to do is... Oh, I can go up here, though? Let's see. This is so crazy. Like, easily the most unique level I've ever played in any Mario game. Ever. <laughs> like, official Nintendo levels, other Mario Maker original levels, Mario Maker 2. This is... This is wild. Oh, I think I know what I can do. Hold on. Let's see if there's a hidden block. Or you can just probably hold up when it goes past the door. That might be what it is. Let's see. Yep. There we go. That is definitely unique. All right. Got ourselves one of the three red coins. I think this is the direction I came from originally. Well, before I go completely out of the way, let me go this direction first so I don't miss anywhere. So this makes you go left. I love how the picture is in the top left of the screen. And this is a dead end officially. There's no direction you can go here. This is wild. So let's go back this way now that I got the red coin. And go up here. Hmm. Second floor. Okay, 2F. So, the Chain Chomp is up there. Let's get closer to him. Oh, that is awesome. That is awesome. Very, very unique. Wow. I don't know how many times I'm going to say unique, but this is... This is crazy. Like, epic levels of uniqueness here. I could only imagine how much time this took to make. My god. That is really weird. Let's follow the directions this is giving here. I already went there. This is a maze. <laughs> Alright, so there is basement one right there. Mm -hmm. 
There it is. Nice. All right, let's go get that door, baby. I cannot get over this level. This is just craziness. Oh, man. What? How did he do that? So it's a a big caterpillar when it comes up close and then this is supposed to be the background of the level. That really messes with your head when you look at it like that. Whoa. I never thought adding slopes to the game would give people that kind of idea to do that with it. That was insane. Wow. That is amazing. Like, epic levels of creativity that I have never seen before in a Mario Maker game. Or like I said, any Mario Maker in any Mario Maker game or any Mario game ever. Like, that's unbelievable. Unbelievable job. Definitely going to like that. Um, yeah, so this is called 3D Maze House. And for those of you who are wondering what the code is for it, let me bring it up for you here. P596985G. It's got a 55.53% clear rate, the world record 37 seconds. This is a themed puzzle solving level. And holy crap, it blew my mind. Like totally messes with your depth perception while playing through it. And just the fact that you can control the picture in the top left corner, depending on the direction you go and the pipes below, it's just, I cannot believe the ideas people think up when making levels in Mario Maker. This is just, I, can't, I don't even know what they'd make next. Like, <laughs> if you can think it up, it can pretty much be done in either Mario Maker or Minecraft. Those two creative games, you can basically do whatever you want in them. This is insane. Definitely interested to see if you guys enjoyed this. Let me know in the comments below what you thought of this level. And if there are any other crazy, unique levels that you think need to be played, let me know about them in the comments section below. That's all I got for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, you stay smashing.